Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. My name is Faisal, and in this today tutorial, I will show you how to make road cross section. So I have this field data, and I will apply a formula here to convert these values in coordinate. You know that every formula starts from is equal, and I will click on fx, fx concatenate. Okay, offset, comma, and then. RL okay just drag this downward as it we will apply here concatenate formula concatenate first comma third box RL okay okay now I will copy these coordinates and open up my AutoCAD new file just enter zoom enter okay and then i will apply polina command and just enter or paste coordinate here space bar enter z enter and t enter we can see here is our ngl level and now i will come towards pgl copy it and again press pl and paste the coordinate here okay here is our pgl I will make the layer for them NGL give the color to the NGL PGL give the color to it cyan ok color depend upon your choice NGL <coughs> PGL and uh, I have required the slope 1 to 1 by 2 I will come towards right side and uh, 2 feet from right side and uh, 1 feet upside and uh, enter C to close it and then I will enter L command and I will come two feet left side, one feet upside. By entering C, I will close it. Delete extra lines. Match it with the PGL. Now extend these lines to the NGL. Boom. Here you can see that our X section has ready. Now we need to draw graph for it. So I come towards the Excel sheet I and I determine that what is my lowest level? My lowest level is 932.180. I will come towards AutoCAD, press PL pull it and 0, comma 0 and enter 930.00. So explode it. Related with it, copy this from here to the here, and then fillet this from here to here. Okay, trim these extra lines, copy this point, and come here, go towards dimension, modify, and uh, text height 1.0. 1.00 okay set current close DAL distance horizontal and vertical distance horizontal distance is 360 360.300 divided by 10 sorry 360.300 divided divided by 10 60.03 horizontal and <laughs> vertical and vertical sixty two point zero one sixty two point zero one divided by ten six point one zero 
so saved six vertical okay now I come towards array command now I come towards array command a double array by array choose rows six rows one column and row offset 10 okay Now I need three sixty seven three seven. Then again, type array one row thirty seven one one point zero select object. Okay. Copy it and uh, paste it here now. Extend this reference line, or you can follow this point. Copy it from here and click on here. Now you can see that here is our reading is 9:30, and here is our 9:30, 32.180. 1 2 and 180 okay so this graph is accurate now I come towards the table I will take the offset of 10 offset of 15 from here 4 times 1 2 3 4 okay <coughs> Filler this line with this, sorry. Filler this with this. Now take ten. Not ten, now set fifteen and offset thirty. okay so now I come towards for some labeling here I will write ngl choose font area three points <coughs> ngl copy it and this of ngl sc Or you can write one point zero zero here. Now it's better. Copy them again. Paste them here. And now I will write PGL and here distance of PGL. Okay. I will write it GUIR one 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 one. Okay, save it. And now I will come to our to fulfill our table. Write Excel command and uh, press V. Now 
copy the coordinate of pgl select the layer of sorry nl and then paste the coordinate here now it has a automatically proposed okay now i am going to load a p file sorry vv file by using ap command i will load vv file load you can see here is the successfully loaded close just enter double v select this line and uh, we have distance first distance will here and uh, ngl will here so here is our distance we will move it little bit up scale it <coughs> rotate it other as it okay now I'm going to write PGL levels I will select the layer of PGL I will delete these extra lines now again enter excel then v and then choose coordinate from here and copy them paste them in command line ok trim line from here and then from here ok now again enter <coughs> the command distance first then level ok here are the <coughs> using match command I will match and uh, then I will give the color it to the PPL. Okay, so that is our table. Now I am going to write <coughs> datum line for this. Copy it and uh, paste it here. And write nine ninety Seventy nine eighty. So we have leave one task to find the area of our cutting. Hatch it with the solid. Click on OK then change the units using units architectural 1 over 8 and then in the ally command here is the area 35.61 35.61 we will write the cutting and filling here copy 
appropriate cutting filling and here is our slope slope okay now I will move it slope is one two cutting 34.61 after scale fit and filling is zero zero so that was the cross section of road hope you have learned something today don't forget to subscribe my channel and uh, like my video and share my video to your friends Thanks for watching a lot of this.